Good morning, all of you. My name is Vikas Kumar Shrivastav. I am running a dedicated coaching center concept library for GATE Aerospace exam. I have qualified GATE Aerospace exam six times, and I have uh, scored a first position in uh, several interviews. For example, IIT Mandi, and uh, I am uh, running this center from 2014, and uh, that was my first batch in 2014. And now my students are taking GATE exam for 2024. Uh, it has been a very very good journey i have learned a lot from my day one of teaching to this it's been 11 years with uh, gate aerospace students and i think uh, uh, i have enough to share which will guide you if you are into self discipline mode uh, for my coaching students i am guiding them properly and if you belong to some other coaching definitely they will be guiding you properly some students they are seeking for a very good guidance so you guys can trust on my videos you guys you guys can trust on my guidance and you can follow this okay one more uh, thing here I, uh, every year i used to start new batch on 15th feb so if your juniors or someone are looking for gate aerospace coaching i have everything full fledged properly designed study material test series video course live classes everything properly so you guys can share this video with them and now this is for you so to in today's video i will discuss that what are those mistakes you should avoid actually uh, i am seeing my students they are taking uh, test series topic wise subject wise full length and uh, when they do mistakes in the test series then i have learned from uh, my own mistakes my seniors my juniors and from last 10 years my students what kind of mistakes they are doing so according to that i am giving you guidance here see when you are choosing the question in your full length test series for example you got question 1 you got question 2 you got question 3 question 4 solving 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 suppose question number 5 you got stuck and uh, then if you have got stuck in the question that time itself you have to divide in three categories you will be having your rough sheet in exam hall on that rough sheet you have to write emt easy medium tough okay means suppose question number 5 you are not able to solve then if time will be remaining then you have to come back to question number 5 right so that question number 5 is easy or medium or tough you have to write down it means how will you judge do you think that okay you tried first time you tried second time and if you will try one more time then you may get the final answer means you know the process but somehow a uh, few things uh, are disturbing you because of that you are wasting your time but you want to attempt this question in that case you should leave the question go ahead again if time is there then come back to this question so when you are coming back to this question so question number 5 will not be only question which will give you this kind of feeling question number 5 question number 13 maybe some other question 25 or uh, 65 like that so you have to make a emt trick this is my trick i used to share every year with my friends uh, with with my students so emt trick easy medium tough trick what is that trick so question number 5 you feel that this question is easy but right now i'm not able to solve so i'll come back so you write down in easy column you write down 5 in your main exam hall i'm talking you write down 5 here then suppose question number 25 you find that uh, this question i don't know and i will never try this question even if time is there i will not be able to solve this question so write down that question under tough category question number 25 so when time will be remaining you will uh, you will come back to that sheet immediately because on your gate exam screen uh those you have not written easy medium trick you have written on the paper page so when you will see that okay this is a question number 5 this is under easy category so you will directly click the button you will jump to the question number 5 and you will try that and you will get your answer maybe question number 12 you have uh, uh, listed down under uh, medium then you will click the medium i mean uh, after question number 5 then you will solve medium questions so i hope you understand that whatever questions you are not able to solve those questions you have to arrange like easy medium and tough categories so that if time is there you will come back and you will initial days when when i uh, when i took my first gate exam i was not having any idea okay these small small things can uh, really make big cha big changes uh, in your result and now let's talk about mistakes when you will do mistakes your rank will come down now see some students uh, even in my uh, test series in decimal they do mistakes okay some students so for, for example i have done mistake once uh, my answer was minus 11 but while uh, typing the answer i forgot the minus sign i kept only 11 so these kind of mistakes are very very common and one more common mistake suppose 
someone uh, suppose you are finding out uh, m value mac number value right suppose you are finding out characteristic mac number so many of us remember that m star square formula right so we get some answer and we used to forget to take a square root of that so these kind of and sometimes uh, in mathematics also these kind of mistakes we do uh, like they are asking x value and somehow we got x square value and because of pressure because in hurry bari we so you have to take care of this that you have to uh, take the square root of this okay now uh, some important point again i will add in this if you are not comfortable with any formula like i don't know uh, i don't have enough practice questions for this particular formula for this particular topic for example suppose in moving shock wave you don't have enough practice questions in that case what you do whatever formulas you have those formulas you keep in mind and go for the exam don't be panic that for this particular question i don't have enough practice for this particular formula i don't have enough practice problem don't worry you are not the only person in in india who is uh, facing this this thing this problem because you you have not been in any coaching center coaching center people they will take care things in different way when they will demand something coaching center people will complete that demand same thing happens in my coaching center for me uh, for my coaching center i have done things properly a uh, topic wise practice and pro properly very proper uh, all the assignments if you will finish in my coaching center that will be more than enough so but if in self study case suppose you feel that okay on this formula i need a, a better uh, questions to solve but you are not finding questions you are searching searching internet here and there you are wasting your time so you solve previous question paper and you see the pace of the questions what kind of level they are asking that will give you rough idea don't take that for granted because any time any year question paper can have drastic change in the nature but i truly believe whatever drastic change is there everyone is going to face that change right so that question paper will not be difficult or different only for you and i also believe that every year 55 55 marks 52 marks 50 marks questions used to be easy easy means if you are a average prepared person definitely you will go to iit for sure and if you have done this kind of preparation that okay uh, that average preparation is uh, done now with this average preparation can i go to iit believe me students who have not covered aircraft structure properly aircraft preparation properly even though just based on aptitude engineering mathematics flight mechanics aerodynamics or rocket and space you can go to iit right see going to iit is not about how much syllabus you are covering going to iit is also about two important things in which category you belong right you are in general category obc category scst category then why are you pressurizing yourself in some wrong direction okay you have to prepare a strategy and you have to think positive every day what is your plus point this video is only for self study students who are not having proper guidance and they are disturbing themselves every day in mathematics you how much you have prepared you go to the syllabus you see that okay in syllabus these are the points and i have covered everything so you are safe side okay because whatever you are going to cover same thing every coaching center and i will teach to students or i will give two videos like okay watch this 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 now if question paper pattern because no one knows right what will be the new question what will be the new question no one knows so that new question how will you predict whatever previous questions they have asked right so try to understand the psychology you don't pressurize yourself that okay my preparation is good or not whatever content you have prepare that content okay now let's talk about self discipline roughly one month is remaining right in this one month you should have a properly well designed your schedule like i will wake up at this am i will do my work and i will finish this 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 part revision you should have every day because if you will not revise every day and suppose you got lag of two days or delay of two days then you will be having anxiety you will feel negative about your preparation okay when students are preparing for gate exam in self study mode then suppose two three friends are together they are preparing then one 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 student will do lot of different thing one student will follow that average thing like okay this 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 is i will follow let's see what will happen you know what happens i have seen people in my time when i was very young in this field uh, some people are like they are sitting with anderson zucker radha krishnan mixon every day and they are like when you will see them they will be loaded with their preparation plans 
with their and they don't do anything they score 18 marks 17 marks 15 marks 7 marks 8 marks like that and i have seen people they will be having a single proper design notes only those notes they will go and they will touch 35 marks 42 marks 38 marks like that and if their category is like a uh, uh, favorable they they may go to iit also they are going to iit also so many things are there you should have one plan for you respect that plan whatever plan you are making but before making plan you have to make sure that plan will work or not okay so for that i am uh, making these kind of small small videos and i don't know uh, what is the number of this video but you go to a playlist i have in that playlist i am giving gate guidance for mtech ms phd admissions for gate aerospace in that playlist so many videos i have done you watch those videos those videos will help you a lot because they are my personal experience videos after teaching of so many years i have got this experience and be here on this channel lot of content are there for gate exam also you cover that uh, if you're following me properly then it will be good i hope you understand where i'm trying to take you i am trying to take you that you have you should have a proper schedule for this one month in that one month ah, one one very important thing you should have a wrap up plan wrap up plan means uh, 10th of uh, feb we have gate aerospace exam right this year for 2024 so uh, gate 2024 aerospace department exam is on 10th you should 10th feb you should have a wrap up plan like in my coaching center many students are uh, finishing their preparation on 10th jan like okay done because they are preparing with me from long long time some students are on 15th done after that they will not learn new things some people 20th because some people they have joined late so they will target fifth first fifth second fifth third also and uh, full length series you solve uh, enough practice enough practice in the sense at one question how many uh, at one topic how many questions you should solve for example, uh, uh, let's talk about moving shockwave. How many questions will be sufficient for you? So see guys, there is something called your basic IQ general, like the way you think. Some students, they know the concept and with that, they know the formula. They can they can crack any new question without having any exercise, any example. Some students are there, they will solve five examples also, but in sixth example, they will get stuck. So you should know your what kind of mind you have. And then you should plan that, okay, uh, five examples will be sufficient for me or two examples will be sufficient for me because in last moment you don't solve so many examples on a particular topic because even we don't know that topic will appear in, in the exam or not so right now best strategy is to cover as max as possible because from one corner easy question may come from another corner tough question may come okay easy and tough you understand so easy if easy question is coming but that corner you have not touched like one very popular question in gator space like uh, how many elastic constants are there for isotropic material? Okay, this is just, uh, it is just fact based question. So somehow if you have covered this portion, you will just tick and you will be getting marks. And the person who has not done that, they are going to lose that mark. So I will suggest you prepare as max as possible. Okay, because if you are in worst condition right now, then only theory part can save you. Numerical part will not save you. Right now, if you are in worst condition, if you, are, if you are feeling that my preparation is not good enough, then only focus on theory. Okay, because theory will save you in some MCQ questions and some MSQ questions. If you will be behind numericals, then actually you are wasting your time because that numerical will consume more time. In that time, you will read a lot of theories. I hope I'm clear from my side. Share this video to those students who want to join for Gate Aerospace 2025 and uh, 2627. Thank you.